Meanwhile, well, well, Martin shares the screen. Hello, hello. Nice to meet you all. Zen decided to keep on, you know, what the marketing group is up to. I already filled out the intake forms. Just keen to brainstorm, you know, what's upcoming. <laughs> nice. Thank you. Thank you. Thank it's you. Good to have you here. Uh, Martin, the other one, the after tunnel agenda of slide. Ah, you want the agenda? Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. Here. This is it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so welcome all. Uh, thank you for joining this breakup room. So today's after town hall uh, meeting agenda. The first thing uh, we'll be giving you, uh, sharing with you a brief introduction about a marketing working group. So this group uh, started uh, six months ago. Uh, for our main focus of this group has been how to market Cardano and its community and the uh, products built by its community because there's always been a problem, uh, a question from the community that we do not get enough support in the marketing form of all the products or the services or the projects we have on the community, on the blockchain, and we uh, don't get enough representation of our stuff at proper places. That's why we are hampering our onboarding process of new people. So this group was formed with people who were very enthusiastic uh, to solve this question and answer the community because as we came into the Walter era where the governance came to the community's hands, so we took it on our uh, hands to move forward in this direction and uh, full like-minded people with us so that we can uh, put, push forward Cardano and its marketing and uh, move forward with it. So, you guys, uh, so that's a basic introduction of our marketing working group. Uh, second thing, I would, uh, uh, next topic is uh, where we are now in our marketing working group. So for the past, uh, two months, uh, July and August, we have been working on to build a draft for the budget committee about the marketing budget and st st structure of how we'll spend it. So we have sent it to the budget committee and we are waiting for review from them. Uh, I'll share with you the link tree. Click on it and check out our uh, drafts. our uh, budget draft and see uh, what we have research, the research we have done, our members and uh, how we have uh, reached to such conclusion about the budget. And you can uh, share your uh, views on it by joining our uh, Discord marketing working group uh, in the intersect. And uh, uh, right now we are working on building our charter so that uh, any newcomer who joins the marketing working group, he can be up to date that this uh, working group is uh, about uh, this uh, marketing card on stuff. What are their plans? How I can help them? How can my skills be helpful for them? And uh, that stuff. And we have built a marketing uh, intake form, a membership members, so that we can uh, have people with expertise and skills so that uh, they can help us market Cardano better and more efficiently and effectively and work together with us to reach a better uh, marketing solution for the community and Cardano. Because as you know, Cardano is a decentralized worldwide community. So there are uh, demand for each region. So we need uh, professionals and experts from across the community, from all the region to guide us as to what they think will be the best way forward in marketing Cardano in their regions. So thank you. And the next part will be uh, continued by Martin. One thing that we want uh, you to tell us, uh, if you, let's say you don't want, don't want to, to join the, the marketing working group right now, uh, 
we definitely need your opinion of how do you think that we as a marketing working group, when we create some documents and when we create some output of our work, how do you think that we need to communicate that to the community, to you and to everybody else that uh, is yet to join the community and to, to be in the Discord servers, either of Intersect or in the Cardano generally Discord servers. So this is our question to you. If you can share some thoughts in uh, Gintama in the chat, I think it's okay. If they share some thoughts of how do you think that marketing working group uh, needs to communicate our uh, our work, our output of our work. And uh, this is the question for today. And of course, if you want to join us, please take the form. Um, I think the form is already in the chat. Yes. So uh, you can take that form and just uh, fill it up. It's very short form. I can show it in the, in the screen right now. Uh, we just want the name and the Discord username, some marketing experience if you have some, and join us to, to be able to uh, give your uh, thoughts and comments on our uh, documents, on the documents that we are pre preparing now and in the future. Uh, so while you are uh, putting your thoughts on the question of how we can communicate with you, uh, please, I want to tell you that tomorrow, on Friday, we are voting for, uh, if you, I get here the, uh, was that? Yes, the slide from before. So we are voting for the champion of the marketing working group tomorrow. So uh, there are a few nominees for that position and the champion uh, needs to, to lead the, the marketing working group and to facilitate and to appoint facilitators for our weekly meetings that we 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 have uh, we have every week so uh, if you desire to be this champion also you can you can participate and uh, uh, yeah apply for that position of course it's it's open thing so everybody can join uh, and yeah if you have any questions uh, please now is the time Martin, I had my raised hand if nobody wants to speak in. I want to quickly chime in, buddy, and understand. Um, I And I would want to, you know, leave you with a few two cents on how we can keep the communication in a single place there as well. I work with Coin Telegraph, you know, as a as a brief. So our core is marketing and, you know, like we do marketing, you know, for all the projects uh, that come to us, you know, in the, in the industry that we have targeted. Uh, but... More on, on the elections, uh, Martin, like where do these elections take place? Uh, you know, sorry for weird questions, but where exactly are these elections taking place? Um, well, uh, I think probably tomorrow we will have, because it's our uh, first, let's say formal kind of election. So okay. our uh, our meetings were uh, uh, originally taking place in, in Zoom calls like this one. But uh, we we tend to move to the Google Meet because we schedule up the meetings every week. So we do that in Google Meet. So probably in some platform, probably Google platform will take the voting. Uh, actually, I cannot tell you more because I'm not sure how we will we'll do that tomorrow. But uh, yeah, we'll do that via some platform. Uh, okay. we, we know the nominees. So I think there are uh, two or three people now. Uh, if Simon can jump in and say, I think he is one of them. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So, um, I'm trying to talk to Terence still to see if we can use uh, a more, um, intersect, like a, a specific intersect tool for that. Otherwise I would think we just do it in, yeah, in the call itself. And maybe we'll also open it up to the community in the chat for a day or two. It's it's right. not a problem to do it even with a with a poll in the in the Discord chat of marketing. The, so. with, yes, well, yes. I, I I see I think so too, but you never know like what you know it could easily be manipulated, right? The you poll know. in the Discord? No, I don't think so. <laughs> I mean, 
I, I, I think I would have a good idea on how to manipulate that. And I'm not like a, a super villain or something. Oh, you have to share that. <laughs> <laughs> so is that Zane? Is it Zane? Zane yes, Khan? Yeah. That's yeah. Will, will you join us tomorrow? Would be great I to would love it. to. Uh, yeah, if if we can, you know, get an invite, I would just love to chime in and you know chill around with you guys. I don't know if I can. Is there's a? I filled out your form. Uh, I don't know if that you know makes me eligible as a, whatever you know, as a member there to join or you know, if you can yes, share an invite, something will be nice. Yeah. Are, are you in the in the intersect Discord? Are you a member? I in am in the Discord. Actually, I'll do one thing, uh, Martin, just to make it easy. I'm just gonna drop you a message in the marketing channel of Discord now. Done. Okay. So you have my Discord there, but I'm in the UA, man. You know, Discord is not the right channel to use. It's sometimes very difficult <laughs> to even connect the chat. Uh, so, but I'll try my best. Yeah. So, so Zane, if you can see, I will just uh, show very quickly on my screen the Discord channel. If you can see the events, Mm -hmm. Yeah, of the channel, you can see the uh, marketing working group tomorrow. It's this is my local time, but if you click, you will probably see your your uh, local time hour of where the marketing group will take place the the meeting, and you can express the interest here, like that, and this is the link for the actual meeting. Right. If you click on the three dots in the middle. You can also add it to your calendar. Yes. Oh, no. Perfect. Thank you, guys. No worries. We'll we'll be happy to have you there tomorrow. And everybody else who wants to join, uh, of course. I think Lara wanted to say something. Lara here. No, it was it was accidental. Sorry. <laughs> I was I was trying to react with an emoji, and then the the raise hand thing is right below that. Uh, okay. Uh, Lara, are you joining us tomorrow for the meeting? I believe I am, unless something urgent comes up, but I I have my time slot on the calendar for you guys every Friday. Nice. We'll have our champion tomorrow. Finally. <laughs> so uh, let me see if uh, we had something else to... Uh, where is that agenda thing? Oh, okay. I want to show you guys the. This is the budget proposal version one that we drafted, and you can check it in the link tree. Uh, there is a link for that there, and these are the marketing initiatives that we already drafted in the in the budget proposal. You can check them, of course, and you can express some thoughts and comments that you have uh, on the meetings or uh, here in the chat. Uh, is also fine, but uh, yeah, we put a lot of effort to to draft it, and in the end of, in the end of the document, you can also check uh, which are the participants that contributed for this document. I think it was somewhere here. Yes, you can see the the people that contributed for this document, and it's a very well drafted document in my in my opinion, and we are working on the same way to draft the others, the new ones now. And this is the link three. Uh, we have a shared Google Drive that we we store all these documents and valuable information. Um, we have meeting agenda backlog, so you can propose uh, agenda topics for uh, the following meetings. We have Miro board, which is uh, very helpful to to brainstorm ideas and to to shape them in some form and actually it was very helpful to to draft the 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 budget the budget document and yeah this is it if you have any questions and please please uh in the chat uh just put some thoughts of uh very quickly like one sentence or two sentences of how how do you think we we can communicate with you uh effectively with the Cardano community, or not only with you, but with the broader community. And uh, thank you for being here. And yeah, we are open to questions.
I'll quickly uh, just, you know, give you my two cents, Martin, on this. Um, I personally feel like Discord is great, but it's very noisy. Just my personal, you know, point of view. Um, and it's usually difficult to tag, you know, the names are different. It's kind of decentralized, you know, in its, in its essence. The right way will be to have a forum, you know, where we are all just, you know, blurbing all of this. But the low-hanging fruit might be a Telegram group. Uh, you know, tied to some bot that sends no notifications, for example. And that's quite global, you know, that won't, you know, anybody wouldn't, wouldn't have issue because everyone is on Telegram uh, if they're in the space, at least major of them. Oh, nice. Yeah, that, that's very good uh, suggestion to use some social media like Telegram. Telegram is a good option, definitely. We, we, may, put that, a... we may put that to agenda and discuss it. Uh, someone proposed earlier also a Twitter account. We have a Twitter account also to to get the information out there. Yeah, Twitter would also be nice. It's nice to have maybe some sort of, I don't know, uh, not for everything, maybe like, I don't know, open golf sort of stuff, you know, a session once a week or, you know, bi-weekly some sort of updates that the marketing group can share. And there could be someone hosting and, you know, building partnerships and, giving a presence for example i've noticed something you know kind of nice in the in the cardano community which is around cardano over coffee where i joined a couple of weeks back as well where they give this 30 minutes of banter and you know 30 minutes of talking about your project in cardano so that sort of stuff can also come up from uh, the marketing side where projects can get some sort of presence and you know get reputation you know basically build on this and this would eventually translate like what exists on Polkadot, if you know, if we use that as a reference point. Yeah, that's that's very good suggestion. Yeah, thank you, thank you for sharing. Uh, Lara, you want to say something? Yeah. So, um, we would advise to keep all of the conversations within the Discord, and although for marketing it is important, creating a Twitter channel separately for the marketing working group is spreading too much because Intersect already has a ton of committee channels a ton of committee Twitter accounts and information is everywhere at all times. So it would be better to coordinate, I think with the Intersect team and the respective committee if the marketing working group gets put under a committee and if it becomes its own committee, then it can have its own Twitter channel. But to avoid that and keep within uh, a place where we can actually sort of control who is a member and who isn't because otherwise we will have non-members of Intersect interacting in the working groups. Uh, okay, but, uh, uh, okay, I understand that for the committees. So the committees are kind of like, as I understood, allowed to have uh, different channels, like social media accounts and uh, the different groups and six, uh, they shouldn't have. Uh, not that they shouldn't have it's not advisable to have because it's already hard as the way it is for people to get information because it's everywhere because of it it, it is decentralized so everyone wants to publicize but no one wants no one knows where to even start to look for that information because it is everywhere yeah yeah so you see uh, what i mean it's just more like it's not that they're prohibited no one's prohibited from doing anything because i can't yeah. just say oh hey I'm gonna block you from creating a Twitter account. I can't do that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, but you are you you uh, advise us, which is very good. That yeah, uh, exactly. Yeah. We just advise because um, I talked to to the Intersect staff a bunch of times about creating Twitter accounts for the working groups, but we have a ton. <laughs> it would be impossible to keep track with all of them, and I think the more spread we are, the less proper engagement a profile gets. So it gets tougher for the people to actually receive the information on their timeline. Okay. Yeah. It, Sorry, it's, Simon. Yeah, go ahead. It's the, I, I've seen the open source Twitter account and they also have a YouTube channel. And I think from talking with them in the, in the summit, I gathered that it's like more of a necessity for them to have it and they would probably rather have it on the main account but that is somehow organizationally not possible right now or i think maybe they didn't get um yeah, for some cases it's really important for the committees to have their own uh, communication channels 
because of the or like for example the elections a lot of the committees have their own um twitter accounts and they are able to publicize them separately and not depend on intersect to release information um and, and try to reach more people that way however imagine if every working group was posting everything every day it'd be impossible Oh, I'd like to intercept you. And uh, we also have uh, Discord threads right now through which we can uh, stay up to the topics and communicate and work asynchronously. So that's how we are moving forward uh, in right now by communicating in threads of respective uh, ideas or uh, topics uh, we are uh, working on. So that's one thing, uh, like the forum, which uh, Zayn suggested. Or having in Discord or something. So uh, we are, if you are, uh, if you join the marketing uh, Discord channel, I've just posted uh, the links to the threads, so you can check them out and uh, share your uh, insights on them. Yeah, but Jintama, we have two ways of communication. So one way is to the internal communication that we all have it in the marketing working group uh, Discord channel. And the threads that's it kind of like for internally, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, and we also we need to we need to have the one sorry for that uh, we need to have the one that we communicate the outputs and not the details and the discussions just the output of what we created to the broader Kagano uh, community and to the to the people. So, uh, but that what what Lara said that we we need to probably suggest that to the the committee that we are under and uh maybe use their channel uh to 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 give the the output of our work so i guess that's an option but we need to see if we are under the mcc committee or uh yeah probably we won't we won't become one very very soon <laughs> so yeah uh, yeah uh, it was more about zane asking about uh, you know communicating internally I was just sharing with, about that. And externally, uh, right now, this is our like first town hall uh, breakup or like after town hall event. And yesterday, we had uh, one more catalyst after a breakup room, after a catalyst meeting. So there also, we had participation and sharing uh, shared information. So this is our first step towards reaching out to Intercept and the Cardinal community about the progress we have made. And uh, moving forward, we will uh, try to bring in new ways, like uh, intersect uh, work hour spaces, where we can uh, keep the people up to date about our working groups, or uh, join community spaces, and uh, invite uh, the broader uh, community to uh, uh, join us and uh, work with us to market Carano. Uh, so right now, we are taking baby steps, and uh, we'd like your support for that moving forward. Okay, so um, I guess there is no no more questions, and I suggest we close this uh, breakout room. Any last thoughts? Anyone? Yes, um, we should get the charter done until tomorrow, if possible. Ah, you are talking internally now. <laughs> yeah, um, let let's go let's go do that in the Discord. Yeah. <laughs> Just saying, it's yeah. like you. We need to get it done. <laughs> yeah, we will. Then just we, you know, we we work for the last day, eight, eight hours, and we get the things done in the last minute. <laughs> yeah, that's probably a not so good sign or not so good thing we're doing right now. Oh, this is what geniuses do, you know. <laughs> <laughs> We're like a rock band, you know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're doing it on the fly. No yeah. problem. <laughs> okay, okay, everyone. Uh, thank you for participating. If you want to join us for the charter eight uh, hour work tonight, uh, come and join us in the, the Discord channel of marketing. And yeah, thank you for participating. And I'm stopping the recording. Thank you for this after town hall, guys. You rock. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, thanks everyone. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.